Ever wonder why delete and truncate sound similar but work so differently? Let's break it down in under a minute. Both commands remove data from a table, but using the wrong one can cost you big time in an interview, or worse, in production. Delete is a data manipulation language or DML command. It removes specific rows based on a WHERE clause. It's also transaction friendly, meaning you can roll it back if needed. Truncate, on the other hand, is a data definition language or DDL command. It clears all rows from a table and often can't be rolled back once committed. It's much faster and also resets identity columns. Think of delete like carefully removing a few items you don't want from your closet. Truncate is like dumping everything out of the closet in one go. So when should you use each one? Delete is best when you need fine-grained control like removing outdated records in small batches. Truncate is ideal when you want an empty table fast like resetting staging data between tests. Now, do you prefer delete for safety or truncate for speed? Comment your role below like SQL developer or data analyst and we'll send you our tailor-made interview prep toolkit PDF. Follow for more quick SQL tips. See you soon.